Hello everyone. It's like 5 o'clock in the morning. I couldn't sleep, so instead of getting up and working out, I got up and finished these little fun Valentine's treat little jars. Um, let me get centered. Um, I'm today after work, I am going to meet two of my friends from my old job. So we meet about every couple months for dinner just to see what's going on. And so we're meeting tonight, and we're probably not going to meet again for another couple months so I wanted to make them a little something an early valentine so this is what I created um again these are those candle or like little candle sticks and you're supposed to put the jar or, or the candle on this end but this end was flat and the jar adhered better and this jar is just an empty um sauerkraut container I got this idea from Anastasia um she repurposed the Yankee candle jar so I was like oh that's perfect instead of buying mason jars these are actually a little bigger and they're cheaper and I can just reuse it so that's what I did I ran it through the dishwasher a couple times and then the lid still had a smell so I had I boiled them and then I just put a bunch of dishwashing soap and let them sit for um like a day so got all that out got it all ready and then so I just spray painted these candlesticks um, on this red they didn't have the primer and color all in one can so I just put the red on and um, it stuck pretty well however it didn't stick too well to the lid I do a bunch of coats on those so then I just put two different colors of ribbon and then I cut out my cupcake I love this cupcake for Valentine's Day so I cut that out I put stickles on the heart and I cut this out from sweet treats at three and a half inches and then I just put some little embellishments on there. Um, these two embellishments I actually I did get at my um, on my last haul, that big haul. I got a bunch of Valentine stuff, so I used those. And then I just put some tulle under the lid, and just cut a little circle. But I put I stamped a little heart on that. And then inside, I'm going to show you. I made these last night. Uh, these little candies these are actually really good I made some extra for work because everybody at work loves these um, I just put a pretzel and then it's a Rolo on top and then you can put any kind of candy I usually use M&M's but since it was Valentine's Day I used the Valentine's candy corn and then you just stick them in the oven on 250 for about 5 minutes to get the Rolo soft and then you push down the candy to get it all smushed together and then I sprinkle um, sea salt on mine it's nice salty sweet little treat there and I have used the regular pretzels before this is the first time I've used these square grid like um, pretzels and I like them better because when you squish them down it gets all into the little grooves and it melts better into them but the other ones work just fine as well so that's my thing oh and I got some um, let me show you the bags I've gotten these little bags when they were on oops clearance after Christmas. So I got these for like 50 cents. I stocked up on my little bags. That was cute. Just solid. Little red. Looks almost like a wine bag but it's not. It's a little bigger. And it's sparkly so I thought those would be perfect for Valentine's Day. Alright guys. Thanks for, thanks for watching. Bye.